a chairman of the Birla group. He has started his career with one of the sad incident his, with his father's beloved father's death. At the age of 28, the all group responsibilities, Birla group's responsibilities folded on his <coughs> and he started to be lead his group. The age group, average age of the, his group was 56 years and his age was 28. He believes that it is necessary to plug the thoughts in the minds and brains of the people. Then your leadership will be appreciated by the people. Dr. R. A. Mashalkar, one of the renowned scientists of our India, he says thoughts and dreams are very important. Great thoughts are going to convert nations, transfer the nations. Great thoughts and great actions are going together. If your actions are going to inform, if your actions are going to inspire others to dream, dream more, to learn more, to do something more activities than your leaders. Leaders are going to create a creative path, courageous path on which people are going to walk. Now we are later. So this is the opinions of the Mashalkar sir. Mashalkar sir was a former, former general director of the CSR. CSIR is nothing but it is a council of scientific and industrial research. If we proceed with uh, Deepak Parekh sir, chairman of the ID, H, HDFC bank, Deepak Parekh sir is saying that if you want to be a great leader, integrity of dreams and vision with which is going to couple with the ground reality then you will be a great leader another one example one of the renowned bankers chanda kochar she has led icici bank as a ceo and managing director she says that if you want to be a leader you have to do some so many experiments on yourself you have to you have to take challenges and you have to think that challenges are your opportunities. Then you will lead a group, you will enjoy your leadership. Dear students, dear friends, leadership is one of the very much important soft skills which is required for in each and every one. So how will you become a leader? For leader to become a best leader, you have to be a, you have to first a resourceful person. How you become a resourceful person? To be a resourceful person, you have to read. Books are the only entity which is going to make you resourceful. Reading, whatever the activities you are doing daily, that activities if you coupled with the reading, 100% you will become master in your area. So with this, before concluding, the book is written by the people, those who are practically worked on the leadership and they have got the various awards by the national and international organizations. So with this, I want that everyone you should read a book per month. I congratulate and thanks to Dr. Aparna Kulkarni Madam and team. Thank you.